Hi guys, so today's video I'm going to show you how I make my um, spicy egg cups. Now you can have this um, in lots of different flavours but I like mine to be um, either spicy or I do a half and half. So for the ingredients I'll show you what I have and I'll show you as well what you can sub. So I've got five eggs, you can have less and these would make approximately six muffin tins or six cupcake tins and they'll be quite full. I also have some mature cheddar which I'm going to grate just for the topping. I have my regular, um, my hot adobo seasoning. I've got some garlic powder, some mixed herbs and I also have some chopped ham. This is just regular ham. I don't use honey smoked ham. This is just regular smoked ham and I also have some salt. Okay, so I've decided to use um, a slightly big jug just because it's got a lip and then that would make it easier to pour into the um, cupcake tin. So if you have anything that's got a, a lip, you should probably want to crack your eggs in that. So to start, I'm going to crack five eggs in, put in some of my seasoning and I'm going to put just a pinch of the Italian herbs, garlic um, powder, a sprinkle of the adobo seasoning and some salt to taste. So I'm just going to put a tiny pinch of that and crack my eggs in here and I'll show you what it looks like. Okay guys, so I've got my seasonings um, all put in. I'm just going to whisk, whisk that together with a fork and just make sure that's um, whisked thoroughly. I forgot to show you guys but I did put in some of my um, my chili flakes obviously to make it hot oops you can, <laughs> you can skip this if you want um, you can put um, some black pepper instead I quite fancy um, the taste of chili flakes in mine next I'm going to put in my chopped ham put that in get some more and I'm just going to leave about that much for the topping and I'm also going to leave the shredded cheese for the topping. I've also got a can of mackerel here. I usually use the smoked mackerel but I'm going to chuck that in just into half of them, so three of them. So this is how creative you can get with these. They are quite versatile. You can swap the ham for minced beef. Um, you can swap it for you know so many things so in goes my eggs now into the cups uh, putting that in uh, we'll have lots of ham and um, a few than the others so let's give that one some ham and let's give the first one some ham and let's give that one as well some <laughs> Come on. Okay. Let's give that one some ham. Okay, so that's me done. Now I'm just going to uh, break up some of my mackerel and then just put that into three of them. So I have three with ham and three with mackerel. So I'll do that and I'll be right back. Okay, so that's all done. So I've got these three with macro and then I've got uh, these ones which is ham and the uh, um, seasoning. So I'm going to put it in the oven now. It's going in the oven for about 20 minutes on a medium heat. And then once it's cooked, I will then sprinkle some grated cheese in it and just put it under the grill for maybe a couple of minutes, two minutes just to brown and give it a nice top. So it's going in the oven now. And that would cook. I'm just gonna set my timer. I'll set it for 15 minutes first and then I'll come back and have a check. Okay and once they're cooked I'll show you what they look like. Okay guys so that's them out of the oven now. They needed the 450 minutes to cook and then I put them on for another two minutes. Um, just to get a good color. So as you can see they're quite poofed up. They will start to drop a little and um, yes yeah, so you can again substitute your protein and your ham for something that you prefer but this is a quick 
um, snack to have on the go is also quick to have for um, breakfast on the go it's quick to have you know just whenever you fancy and it's really easy to make and you can have a variety of flavors as you please so I'll plate this up and I'll show you some reveal shots at the end thank you so much for watching see you soon bye